This is gonna be cute. Hi guys, welcome to my channel. It's your girl Bri Bri Cooks and we are back today with another haul. This time we are doing a sheen haul and it's gonna be mixed with a little bit of winter and summer because I've had some of these clothes for a while now that's been sitting in the box that I didn't even get to try on. So I'm gonna try on everything. I got so much clothes y'all, like so much. Look at a bag full of stuff. So it's gonna be a big haul. Stay tuned. All right guys, so I got this like little rib knit crop top, very good quality. And there's nothing much more to say about this one, but um, it fits nice. Your girl gotta lose some weight before I put this thing on because it is very cropped, as you can see. It's more, it's not even like, I wouldn't even consider this like a crop top. I would consider this like a bralette, but um, real nice. And I have one, I ordered another one just like this, a little longer. That one is more of a crop top. This is a bralette. So I ordered like a whole bunch of flannels. Um, I was just really feeling the whole flannel jogger look. This one, um, this one I already wore. I wore it to Atlanta, to Six Flags. Um, this one is very thick. So um, if you're looking for something like thin, just like a regular flannel, this is not that. This will um, like keep you kind of warm. But um, I really like it. I bought it to wear with my court purples. And it's really comfortable and cozy. So, that's that. Okay, this one is also kind of thick. This one reminds me of like that robe um, pajama pant material. It feels like real pajama ish. It does. I ain't gonna lie. But it's real cute. And um, this will also like be more of a warm thing. I don't know if you could kind of see the material on camera, but yeah, it's like real cozy. Um, most of these flannels I'm not even going to be able to wear that much unless I'm like going out of town or something with they. Because your girl lives in Miami and it's too hot for these. Okay, and then I have the green one. This one is also... Um, kind of thick and um you can see me here like smelling it because it smells like mildew i don't know if it's i really believe that maybe it's the material they made it out of but it stinks so i'm gonna have to wash this um you probably should wash all this stuff anyways but some of the stuff i did wear already because i've been on a few trips this one is not really like fuzzy but it is kind of like thick i'm pretty sure to keep a it'll do a good job at keeping you warm then you have this black and white flannel. I wanted more of like kind of like a little cotton type of more casual flannel. This, I don't know how to describe this material. Let's see if it says it. Polyester and spandex. So you can kind of get an idea. It feels like, um, like blousy. Like, y'all know what I'm trying to say. Like, it feels like a work shirt. You know how those blouses, the material, it like stretches. Um, I mean, I've been making it work, but I really want it kind of like that cotton-like flannel. But whatever, it's cute. It's still cute. It gets the job done. Okay, so this is the denim coat. It's um, basically kind of like a long line coat. It is too big for me. I should have sized down, but... I'm still gonna make it work. I got it in a medium. I wish I would have got it in a small. And I'm also gonna have to throw this in the washer because it smells like bleach. But it's cute. Hopefully it shrinks in the dryer. Next up I have this little white and black blouse. It looks crazy right now. But um, if I would have just saw the shirt online, I would have never bought it. Like I would have never thought it was cute. So I saw it on um, this Instagram model, whatever. I don't remember her name, but um, I was like, oh, you know, that's a real cute shirt. And then I was scrolling on Sheen and saw it on Sheen. So I was like, oh, let me order it and see how it look on me. Yeah, this shirt does need some TLC. Mm, I'm gonna have to get some boob tape or something because it looks better when the cleavage is up and out there. I'm gonna have to push some things up and put some tape to make sure it stays. The shirt, it doesn't feel cheap, but it feels like one of those shirts like the strings might keep coming loose. 
So you just have to be careful where you put them when you're in the shirt. So that's that. And then speaking of being careful, um, I have this look, the strings don't fill out. Like these shirts are just out of control. But I am in love with this shirt. Oh my gosh. It's so cute. I think it also comes in other colors and styles. Like it comes like a tank top. I think it comes in black and white. I never really seen people too much with like the purple one. I'm so in love with this. It's so cute. I think this is probably like one of my favorite items out of the whole haul. When you wear this shirt, do not make any sudden movements. Don't be pop locking and dropping it too hard because gonna be popping literally you and the shirt gonna be popping it titties gonna be popping out the shirt the strings gonna be popping everything just gonna be popping um i don't know if i'm gonna show the video because i think my nipples were out but even when i raised my hands like everything just came loose we gonna have to figure that out i might have to put some some boob glue or tape to also we'll, we'll figure it out but it's cute i think y'all should get it next we have this little china t-shirt i'm sure y'all been seeing this all over Instagram and social media. I thought it was going to be one of those like cheaper versions, but it's actually pretty comfortable. It's nice quality. And I think they also have a tank top one. I think I want to get that one too. I paired it with these red um, like little sweatpants. I don't know how I feel about these because that's what I wanted. I wanted sweatpants and they feel more like joggers. Um, you can see here like they just they fit baggy in the crotch area. I probably should have sized down too. I think they're medium. Yep, they're medium US 6. I probably should have sized down. And they're long. But um, yeah, they kind of almost feel like, like these feel cheap. They kind of almost feel like pajama pants. I think I'm gonna just wear these in the house and get some red sweatpants from Fashion Nova or something. But I don't know, we'll see about that. And then I also paired it with this um, black china shirt. It's really cute. I love how it cuts open in the front. And this also fits like a crop top. Um, doesn't feel cheap. Okay, so next up I have this t-shirt that says next. It's a real cute, simple t-shirt. And I really like this. Um, it's actually a crop top. I said well, a crop top. Crop top t-shirt it's really good quality i love how it fits um with this one like i don't even really need a bra well i see how it look on the screen but i didn't think i needed a bra t-shirts and stuff like this like the bra just throws it off so the fact that i get to wear it without a bra is a win for me and i love it it feels really good it's almost kind of like stretchy all right so i paired it with um this little skirt dress thing i don't know how i feel about this so first of all i think they had like three different ones one is like a cotton one this one is like a spandex polyester one i wanted the cotton one i thought that's what i was ordering yeah this is not for girls with the fupas because i don't know i was just getting pregnant vibes wearing this like i might have to wear some type of faja or something i don't know maybe when i'm in the moment getting dressed up I'll probably like it better, but I don't know. I just wasn't feeling it like I thought I would. And then maybe I got it too big. Maybe I should have sized down. Okay, so I have this black bodysuit. It's kind of like that spandex material. I love how the top is. The top fits like perfect. But um, it is a little baggy in the crotch area, but I feel like I, that, I have that problem all the time because I'm short and you know i have a little weight on me so i kind of have to size up for things to fit over my hips and stuff but then it gets like baggy in that area because i'm so short but um it's pretty comfortable i wish it was kind of like that material that um the fashion over body suits have this is kind of like a workout kind of um i don't know i'm, I'm gonna wear it out but it's cool i like it it fits nice it makes my butt look good so Okay, and then I have this shorts romper. Um, pretty decent quality, comfortable. It fits kind of perfect. It's like not too tight, not too baggy. It's like comfortable. I'm sure when I wash it, it's probably gonna shrink. You see here, I show you how it looks with the zipper up and down, if you want some cleavage or not. Okay, so next we have this gray um, two-piece set. 
This was a little baggy on me. I probably should have sized down. But um, it's comfortable. Um, I'm most likely going to be wearing something over it. Like a, a shirt or something. This is kind of, it gives me kind of like green gray. But um, other than it being like a little baggy, I like it. It's decent. And then we have this like two piece set. This this set is like a really proper dupe for some um designer. I don't remember who it was, but is it K1 Alien? I think. I don't know. I don't remember. This was also a little baggy on me. I wish I would have sized down. Hopefully when I put it in the dryer, this shrinks as well. It does have like green stitching on it. Um I don't know if you guys can see that but um it's comfortable it has like the stretchy workout material the top was like really big to the point where like i might have to like tie it when i wear it because i don't want my boobs popping out so yeah That's all right so these next few items i was kind of going for like the whole skins yeezy comfy look so I was really looking for like some solid skin like neutral color pieces so the first one I got is this brown rib bodysuit it does has um have the the snap pieces <laughs> run it up out of in the name of Jesus a demon that coughs in Jesus name I pray amen amen and amen again it's done. It's really comfortable. I'm not sure if it came in other colors, but I am going to go look because I might order, order that one in other colors. I paired it with these joggers sweatpants. These are sweatpants. These are like really good material. This is what I was looking for. I wish the red ones came like this. And um, I'm going to go see if this is also in other colors because I really like it. If it's perfectly, it's like thick, it's not cheap. I'm sitting here trying to figure out what this thing is because I washed this and I don't know what this is, but it is not coming out. But yeah, they are so comfortable. I'm going to go see if they have it in other colors. I also paired it with this um, like brown, um, I don't know what you call this material, but um, I love it. It's like nice and thick, good quality. The color is like a... Like it's not brown, it's like a mauve. I don't know how you explain it, but this is so nice. It's giving me those VZ Kim vibes. And um, I also got it in another color. The shirt is somewhere, but I'll show it in a little bit. And then I got two, um, like, I wanted to get like different beige kind of top so so this one I wasn't feeling like the color when I got it because it's kind of like a peach yellow and I'm like how am I gonna wear this what am I gonna wear it with but as I tried it on again I really like it I'm really liking it I just want like a regular beige t-shirt like that's just been my vibe lately t-shirts sweatpants sneakers hats like being comfortable, that's just my vibe. Cause I don't go, well, we can't go nowhere. So um, it don't really make no sense to buy clothes, clothes. So I just been buying like comfy stuff to go to the store in. All I did have were outfits to go out. Like I didn't have any casual run to the store clothes. So I'm racking up. But this, oh yeah, this is like a thicker t-shirt. It's really good quality. It's very comfortable. This is also like one of those shirts. It's so thick that you don't need to wear a bra. So I like that and this shirt that I'm also wearing right now, it's also very comfortable. I don't know if you can see my nipples, but as you can see, I'm obviously not wearing a bra. It's really, this one is thinner, but it's still comfortable. And this one, I feel like it's like the perfect length. Like it's not a crop top, but it's not like super long. And this one is more on the pink, like blush side. So yeah, I just wanted to get some t-shirts that were like a different beige, so. And then I paired it with this beige flannel. I was really on the hunt looking for a beige flannel. I don't know if you guys can see it, but this one is like really fuzzy. Like as soon as I pick it up, all the stuff is flying around. It's really like it's shedding straight up. But it's really cute. Um, this one is on the thicker side, so it will keep you warm. And I can't wait to wear this. This is real cute. All right, so this is the other tank top I was talking about. It's literally the same tank top 
as the other one but that one is more like a bralette this one is more of like an actual crop tank top literally the same thing same material stretchy i don't remember how it looked when i tried it on but we'll see in the video here if a bra was needed because most of these items that i tried on i I did not have a bra on, so typical me. But yeah, that's that. And then I paired it with like these um, patchwork shorts that's been all over Instagram and social media as well. They fit perfect. Like I have no complaints. Um, they do feel like swimwear shorts, which I have no problem with because you know your girl lives in Miami and this just screams like a Miami fit. This is it right here. I really like these. So here you'll see me pairing it with a bucket hat. I'll also be doing a sheen accessory haul. So um, stay tuned for that. And then I also paired it with this um, like backless spaghetti strap shirt. This is like a real cute and simple and sexy shirt. I feel like it could be dressed up or down. Um, really nice thick material. I haven't really had any complaints of anything feeling like cheap except for what was it like the two-piece gray set this one you can kind of tell it was like the knockoff version that one and then what else the red sweatpants that was the only thing that i felt was kind of like cheap okay so this fit i was not really feeling um i don't know what i was thinking but i thought i ordered this in more of like that ripped t-shirt type of material and it's more of a like polyester stretchy material and i don't know if it was the length or let me see because i think this is supposed to come up some more maybe i should have scrunched it up because you see how that looks on that side so maybe when i scrunch it up more it'll look better because i wasn't really feeling this i wanted to kind of wear like a t-shirt but the material feels more dressy, so I'll probably be wearing it out like with some jeans, some cute hair, something simple. And then these gray sweatpants, I was kind of going towards that whole like sexy basketball short type of look with my Jordans. But um, I'm so damn short, I don't like how long these were on me. The material was cool. It did come with some strings that I had to pull out because the one side came out, I don't know how. It has a little pocket on this side. Yeah, they were cute. They were just, I, don't, I just don't like how long they were. And then I have this butterfly t-shirt that was way too big. I probably should have sized down to me. Yeah, definitely should have got a small. I was looking for an oversized shirt, but not this oversized. Like, but other than that, it's a cute shirt. I already got makeup on it. I had another white plain shirt that I bought and I couldn't even show it because it's like ruined. I washed it, I bleached it and there's still makeup stains on it and I'm hoping this comes out because I do, even though it's big, I do want to wear this. Alright guys, so this set I was the most excited for. I saw it and I was like, oh my gosh, I have to have this. And I actually, I was praying that it fit because I plan on wearing this for my trip to Mexico in a few weeks. And the top fits fine, and as you can see, the sh the um, it looks crazy right now. But that's the front, and then it ties in the back twice, up and down. I have no problems with the top, but the bottoms are freaking huge. Like they look like clown pants. Um, I know that they are supposed to fit a little baggy and long, but they are like too big. I highly doubt I can send this stuff back because I ordered it so long ago, but I'm going to try and not because I already plan on having, like, I literally ordered like six pairs of jeans and none of them fit how I wanted to fit. All of them are baggy or too long or both. So I also know when I'm praying that they fit because as of now, like, I have no it jeans right now. Like, like look how big they are. So I really have to go get this altered because... I am wearing these for a trip with these jeans they they fit pretty decent like these I might not have to look at all too I could probably just throw them in the dryer one time they're a little baggy but if I would have sized down they wouldn't have been over they wouldn't have been able to go over my hips like they they fit nice and snug around the hips so a size under probably wouldn't have even fit but they're pretty baggy and long at the bottom so I'm pretty sure I can just pull off the whole wide fit 
leg thing and then probably put on a belt. But these are actually cute. I actually kind of like these. Paired it with this white hop to top. I really like this top. It is so cute. It's different. Doesn't feel like cheap. And um, this came like separately and it wasn't in the sheen bag. It came like this. It was kind of weird. Like it was sent from somewhere else. What's that about sheen? I keep saying sheen and I think it's sheet in. Okay, so I have this like one shoulder tie-dye bodysuit. This is so cute. It fits perfectly. It's comfortable. I love the material. This is really cute. It's giving me like pretty little thing vibes. I can't wait to wear this. This is cute. Okay, so I have this little multi renaissance print little crop top with the green lining. This is so cute with like some green heels. And we're going to see here in the video if my nipples were showing because it looks pretty see-through. But when I looked on camera, I don't know. I didn't, I didn't see like my nipples out. This is so cute. Okay, so I have this turtleneck bodysuit. It's really tight, especially like around the arm area here. I don't know, online it looked like a navy blue. I thought it was going to be navy blue and it's actually black. I have no idea what bottoms to wear with this top. Y'all help me out. I'm lost. Because I was going to wear like the black leather pants with the split leg that everybody's wearing. I have those from Pretty Little Thing. But I don't know. I'm not feeling that with these. I don't like it with jeans. By the way, the jeans that I'm wearing with this, I would not wear with those. They look a mess. It was just for video purposes. But yeah, what should I wear with this? And it's a bodysuit, by the way, because it has the thing at the bottom. But to my great surprise, ever since I looked in your eyes. 